B slash 12. Uncovered alien artifact. Similar to Thorian Mind Orb from episode 21 of Bladdor's Quest. Proceeding back to diner, I mean lab, where I will conduct in-depth analysis. Yes! Contact! <laughs> gonna be close, boys. Finally, a challenge. Oh, sorry, were we racing? Oh, man! Whoa! <laughs> Zeke, have you lost your lug nuts? What's the deal? I know the truth! Every single one of you. <sighs> hey, Sherm, do we need this part? That's the brake spinner. <laughs> Guys, we got company. Uh oh. Well, <laughs> darn Zeke, right. No, wait. Hey. <laughs> Triple geranium crystal plating. An obvious alien alloy. <sighs> Zeke, fancy me... watch from Japan, huh? <laughs> I think not. <laughs> and these sentient signs for leader, scout, hunter. <laughs> what did you just say? But if you kids are really in cahoots with the aliens, you'd need an underground base. <laughs> Underground base? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Nothing like that around here. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what you're talking about, Zeke. Ah, uh, the toilet is clogged in our secret underground base. Oh. Nice one, Stanford. This is bad. Very bad. <sighs> Cover me in batter and dunk me in a deep fryer. Crystal-based nanotech. Greetings. I am Sage. Oh. <gasps> hmm? What is this thing, Sage? A sentient data log. When my homeworld was overrun by the Sark and Vandals, the Council of Five protected the combined knowledge of our civilization by... Downloading it into data logs and launching them throughout the multiverse. The hope was that survivors would collect them and bring them to a safe zone so we could rebuild. The world must know of this! No, we don't need the government meddling with our mission. Knowing them, they'll just mess things up and let the aliens in. Oh, you're right about that. Hmm. Uh, Zeke, how do you know all this stuff? Well, it all kind of happened after I got struck by lightning. It must have fused the data inside this log with Zeke's mind. Well, let's get the data out of his mind and find this safe zone. 
Whoa, 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 now. You ain't probing my mind. You want to get to this safe zone? I'll take you there. You know the coordinates? Sure do. <laughs> sure do. <laughs> sure do. <laughs> sure do. This is getting sure weird, do. people. Sure do. The human brain sure is not do. equipped for the massive sure amount do. of data within sure these logs. Do. Meaning the information in Zeke's head is probably unstable and could be wiped out at any moment. A sound hypothesis. Sure do. And we better sure use do. Zeke's knowledge before sure that happens. Sure do. I, I sense a storm shock approaching. Who wants to hit a battle zone? Initiating system protocol. Constraining nulls up to vectors. Cyclotron cycling. Data log readings at maximum. Let's roll Battle Force 6! Battle Force 6? Actually, it's still 5. I just quit. Vert, I'm not sure taking Zeke into the zone is a good idea. If he can lead us to more sentient tech or even survivors, then it's a chance we have to take. Okay, guys, let's burn some rubber. <laughs> Deal with the data log. It syncs with a storm shock portal to take us to the right battle zone. Oh, what about our enemies? Will they have access to the zone too? Well, here's hoping. is just like episodes 34, 51, and 62 of Blador's Quest all smooshed together! You watch Blador's Quest too? You are aware that Blador's Quest was based on the far superior British show with the same name. Hey, Zeke, where to now, buddy? Yeah, we want to get a jump start on any enemies in this zone. Too late! Sark at 12 o'clock! Battle Force 5, you know the drill. Zeke, we'll handle the rough stuff. You stay out of Down the with the Zark Empire! Sherman, get Agora out of there! Let's roll! Stanford, Zoom! Time to wreck some Sark. Wrecking Sark is how I relax. I can help. No thanks, you've done enough. We got him! Sentient data pod. Zack, retrieve it! They're going for the data log. Zeke, hang tight. We'll save you. Lador faced just such a predicament in episode 42 of Lador's Quest. Yeah, yeah. He was able.
able to divert the energy from his ship and short-circuit the attacking robots. With an EMP blast! Sarg, system damaged. Must retreat and prepare. Electromagnetic pulse! Woo! Keep hitting them with that and we're golden! It can do it once every four hours, and only if you reroute the power through the mini hadron colliders. And that EMP blast was pretty impressive. <laughs> I think I'm getting a hang of this hero stuff. Uh, Bird, go to channel four. We need to send him back now, before he drops an obelisk on someone else. He didn't mean it, Agora. <sighs> Is this the sentient safe zone? Mm, scanning memory bank. Mm, scanning, scanning, and <laughs> Hey, buddy, are you all right? <laughs> I'm not sure I'm interpreting the data correctly, but we need to head into an interzone. A zone within a zone? Like in episode, episode 33, 33 of Blador's Quest. Quest! One more mention of Blador's Quest and I'm gonna lose it. How do we get into a zone within a zone? Um... <sighs> ah, the instructions don't say. Well, if we need to get into another zone, we're probably looking for a portal of some type and a key. Huh? And if we assume this is the key, then all we're looking it's for... a keyhole. Everyone spread out and search. Looks like they're cowering before some sort of guardian. A phoenix? I think I've got something. There's faint energy readings from the top of that obelisk. Of course, that data log. Akura, climb up and insert the data log. No problem, but make sure Zeke doesn't knock it down while I'm up there. <laughs> <laughs> Stay back from the vortex. Oh, we'll disintegrate. We get it. Sark, closing fast. Destroy organics and retrieve sentient artifact. It is leading them to something. The only question now is why? No. When? No. Uh, how? What? The only question is what? Zeke, the data log! This is just like episode 26, Bladdor's Last Stand, where he was trapped with no chance of escape and had to make a leap of faith into a swirling neutrino galaxy. Awesome! Hmm. The Phoenix! Everyone into the vortex! Excuse me? Vert! Where Vert goes, I go! Yes! I can't believe I'm doing this. Out of the frying pan and into the vortex! Whoa, that was intense. Whoa. The Enter 
Danger Zone. Oh. Oh. Cool. How'd you know we would rematerialize? The Phoenix represents rebirth, something that's destroyed but then reformed. You risk our lives based on artwork made of stick figures? No risk, no reward. Okay, everyone, let's move. It won't take Zemrick long to figure it out, too. The organic self terminated. The Earth is defenseless. Jumping into a vortex of antimatter is completely illogical. The organics are illogical. That is what makes them weak. Or perhaps that is what makes them strong. Zack! Must be it. Sentient survivors could be behind that door with the answers to everything I've always wanted to know about the universe. Then let's crack it open. Could the data log be the key? No. According to the sentient hieroglyphics, I think you're supposed to press this. <laughs> That sounds like someone just turned on the world's scariest air conditioning unit. Look! Energy! Huh? I think we have to connect these pipes so it flows from there to there before the energy leaks. A puzzle? Puzzles hurt my brain. A positron flow lock, to be precise. <gasps> Everyone else, it's slice and dice time. A few more pieces, and I'll know everything. The secrets of the multiverse. Hold it at last! Ah! Shred it! Ah! Oh no, you don't! Ah! Ah! Okay, easy. Easy, that's gonna. Tied up. Well, in one sec, I'm gonna be all drilled up. Easy. Yes. Oh, baby. There we go. <laughs> so close. Someone help me. Uh. <sighs> I can't believe I'm doing this. Access to vault denied. Perfect. You pathetic post-protozoan organisms! May you rot in this zone forever! Hey! What? 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 Recalculating! Sark intruders. Zone compromised. What? Initiating self-destruct. Time to get out of here. Let's get to that portal. Self-destruct in five. Move, move, move! Four. Three. Two. One. Zero.
zero zero one. EMC squared to double cheeseburger, huh? Mama's oh. a cow's cheese His brain is finally overloaded. It's deleting all the sentient data. Is the old chap gonna be okay? I hope so. I like turtles. He saved my life. He will be fine, but he will not remember anything from the time of the lightning strike. All right, guys, let's get him back to the desert. <laughs> they are coming. <laughs> <sighs> well, I'll tell you what, I conked out in my truck, and I had the wildest dream. <laughs> dream? Yeah, about interdimensional battle zones and killer robots and aliens. <laughs> and the best part, you were all there. <laughs> really? This sounds uh, pretty far-fetched. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, my recorder. I'm sure I documented my discovery of the alien artifact. Log entry 31B slash 12. What in blazes? I didn't know you were a fan of the Battle Force 5. Great punk band. Oh. Nicely done, Stanford. <laughs> Nicely done. <laughs> <laughs>